Well, it was the beginning of August when the Douglas Corporation gave approval to start work on the sunken garden walls. As of course, it was last year in the storms that this all had a terrible impact and was hit and a massive amount were taken away. Actually, what you see behind me is actually just on one of the posts for some lighting. So this is not done. It appears so far they've been taking away the stone and uh, getting ready to start on it. Of course, £200,000 has been estimated. It's taken this long to get to that stage due to loss of justice getting involved and, and so forth. But they've got the green light, but uh, it's not going to be cheap, that's for sure. And of course, many people are going to question the timing now. The whole summer, it's been like this, and we're going into the autumn and then, of course, the winter and more storms. So who knows if this will be finished in time, but it's certainly been long overdue for many people who think this has been quite an eyesore to see this. Again, other people think the sunken gardens maybe should be the raised gardens so they could keep out all the storm water in future. But that's for another day. In the meantime, we'll come back and check on the work that's been done here and uh, see how the progress is being made to get these walls back up and in ship shape, hopefully before the end of this year, hopefully, and then we can see if it can ride out any future storms that the uh, RSC can be sending over to us.